The trial of British socialite Gilan Maxwell started today. She's on uh, trial for sex trafficking charges, as well as charges alleging that she recruited young girls as young as age 14 between 1994 and 2004 to be sexually abused by Jeffrey Epstein, a financier who killed himself as he was waiting trial on sex trafficking charges in 2019 killed himself at a uh, federal jail right next to these courthouses behind me. Today, as the uh, prospective jurors were brought in one by one into a courtroom, they were questioned with Gilan Maxwell sitting there with her lawyers. So she can actually see what these people are like, see how they answer the various questions, and help her lawyers decide which ones they would like to be choosing her fate when a uh, verdict probably comes in sometime in mid-January or so. Today, they, the individual prospective jurors were being asked questions about things like uh, whether they've uh, had sexual attacks in their history or been sexually harassed, and whether, if they were, they can still be fair and impartial in deciding the fate of Gilan Maxwell. They were also asked questions about what if someone's really wealthy? Can they still be fair toward that person? Because during uh, uh, pre-trial developments, as Gilan Maxwell's lawyers were trying to get her freed on bail, they revealed that she's worth about $22.5 million. So it probably will come clear during the trial that she was of some wealth and influence. And the judge wants to make sure that you know, these prospective jurors can be fair and impartial despite the wealth that's involved.